Hey guys, I hope you're doing a fantastic day today because I'm showing you how I cut the jackfruit today. A while ago, I made a video on TikTok eating jackfruit and many of you have asked me where I bought it or where to find it. I got lucky finding this place in Surrey where they sell many exotic fruits but the store owner told me that they get a lot of fruits imported from Mexico. One day I'll be making a video of me visiting the place and show you what kind of fruits they sell. That way when you guys are interested, especially if you live in Vancouver, you can personally visit the place. Or if you live somewhere in Canada and wanting to visit Vancouver, you can easily make your way to Surrey to buy jackfruit and any other fruit. As many of you know, jackfruit is a popular fruit in Asia, especially in the Philippines. Filipinos are crazy about jackfruit, including myself. And oh, by the way, I would like to thank those who subscribe to my channel. I now have over 1,000 subscribers, so thank you so much everyone. And if you're interested or wanting to learn more about the Philippines, please subscribe to my channel and learn about our culture, food, as well as dating a Filipina. And if you want to see short clips of me talking about life, silly things, and other crazy ideas, please visit my TikTok page at Helga Babushka. My TikTok page is full of sarcasm and silly jokes. So just to warn you, if you can't handle sarcasm and have no sense of humor, I advise you not to visit my page. Okay, Helga, enough with your TikTok nonsense, please. Back to the jackfruit topic. Oops, sorry sir, mister. Anyway guys, jackfruit in the Philippines is very cheap and it's easy to find it anywhere in the Philippines unless it's the season. Also, did you know that jackfruit is called Nangka in Malaysia, Indonesia, and the Bisaya dialect? However, in Tagalog, we call this Langka. And jackfruit can also be consumed in many types of recipes and styles of cooking. And did you know that in the Philippines, we consider jackfruit as a vegetable when it's green? So usually, we Filipino would cook it with fresh coconut milk and add any meat. Otherwise, we can cook it in many types of recipes. And when it's ripe, we can make many dessert styles like famous Halo Halo, Toron, and many more to mention. And also, it can be dehydrated as chips. Jackfruit is also known to have many health benefits. It can lower the risk of health issues such as constipation, ulcer, diabetes, high blood pressure, and skin problems. And according to my research, if you're struggling with losing weight, consuming jackfruit in the right amount of weight can be beneficial due to its high fiber, which helps improve digestion and metabolism. However, jackfruit can cause diarrhea when consuming too much if you drink a lot of water. But on the other side, jackfruit has many excellent benefits. And if you're unsure about consuming due to health issues that might interfere, I suggest inquiring more about consuming or perhaps talk to your doctor. Also, I have to say one thing about cutting jackfruit if you haven't done it before. The best thing to get rid of the sap is to use oil. The best one is coconut oil to remove the sick part. Otherwise, any oil will do. Also, I'm not quite sure if I'm cutting the jackfruit in the right way since my dad or mom always cut the jackfruit in the Philippines. 
but I think I'm doing a good job. And if you're wondering about the jackfruit seeds, if they can be eaten or thrown away, the answer is yes, they can be eaten. In the Philippines, we usually boil it till it's thoroughly cooked. Then we eat the way it is or consider it as a snack. And I will make a video of how I cook it and eat it. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoy this video. Be sure to like it or even better, comment down below. Have a nice day everyone! Paalam and see you next time!